Yeah, yeah did you? <laughs> I guess we can go over Conveniently the... forgot about it. Everyone's shopping list after the fight, and we can decide what we did and didn't buy. Just remember, everything's stunned until in that room there, uh, Lee, until my round. Mm hmm. I haven't forgotten. I don't remember. Did I. Well, I guess I can't see into the room real well. I don't think I, I got. No one's been gotted. Yeah. Just mega stunned. But Obo would be next while everybody's shopping if Obo would like to. Obo her way in there. Uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, um. Elbow gonna just elbow her way in there. That's, that's what we do. Yep, there we go. Alright, elbow's in. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll come to this one over here. I don't think anybody's hit anybody yet or anything like that, huh? I don't know. Uh, they've just been stunned. Yeah. Okay. Also, this is what they look like. I put it in Discord. I don't know if I had a better picture for them and this is a game. Okay. Um, right. <laughs> yeah, okay, that's great. <laughs> I guess I'll just swing. Swing away. Swing a ding. First roll of the night. 28 to hit. This lovely creature story. Let me just jump over to... Yep, that's a hit. 18 slashing damage. I'm on the wrong thing. Alright. Ouch. Yes, sir. Stunned Sky, sky Sales turn. Lovely, lovely. Alright, Munchie. Alright, I am going to. You wild them. No! No! Not the pancake shooter. Uh, 21 to that guy. <laughs> That is a hit. Alright, hold on. Let me do it again. No, don't do that. Uh, 26 to that guy. Sorry, that one doesn't... No, yeah, that hits. So it does 9 force damage to the first guy and 12 force damage to the second guy. Okay. Ouch. Can you stop it? Alright. You want me to do it a third time? I mean... You feeling lucky? Is there a third creature? Uh, Obo. No, uh, Obo, I'd just feed a pancake too. <laughs> Here you go. He spent my third action to feed Obo a pancake. <laughs> Thank you, little one. Nom, 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 right. nom. <laughs> yes, yeah, I'll allow it. Fuck it. Uh, no, that's it. All right. Sky Sail's turn. All right, it is going to really. We well, all got some pluses, so we'll see. <clears throat> all right, so it's going to try to slap you with its tendril. Here we go. I too confused what this tonight is. Come here, Obo. It wants you. Jesus! Whoa! Ouch. They're grabby. They're very grabby. Alright. So a little 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 dam. Little damn zoni. Alright. Of course, of course. Uh that would be doesn't tell me what kind, but it doesn't matter. Now it says plus grab. Does that mean automatic? Uh, that's what it sounds like to me, that on hit it grabs. Ooh, boy. Alright, now I want y'all to know. I'll give everybody a perception check in the middle of this. Well, everybody in the room. And I will allow Theodore as well. <laughs> <laughs> See, I don't like the way that you're giving us that. Much he sees the future. It's not even max. 
Blorp. Looking in there. Yeah, you definitely see, like, it doesn't, like, hurt him too much to, to grab him. But it's definitely, like, sticking. Like It's got, like, little barbs, and it's starting to, like, seep into his skin. Obo has no idea what's going on. Ah! Plant monster! Me. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on right now. Yeah, it's not it's not good. Glib I'm banging. I can't. Oh good. Give me God dang it, give me a second. I swear, Kato, if you can't lay down and go to bed. If you want to change what's on, Colton, ask Eli to change it to the sleep time show. Give me a second, guys. Yeah, I'm about to come down there and fix that if he can't be quiet. Ask Eli to change the video if you want. Yeah, you just go to YouTube and look up uh, Soap ASMR. He loves that video. He's a weird child. So, Kato, if I have to come down there, I, I'm, I'm telling you, dude, it's going to be a bad night. Used to watch some of that. <clears throat> yeah, just some people like cutting soap or like squishy, people just squishing like slime all night. Yeah. He just, he passes out so fast. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. Why is everybody up? The only person that should be up is Eli. Sorry, guys. What you doing, Glib? Sorry. Bang. Why I scream at me? Yeah, I figured, but it's why I scream at my kids when you want to shoot one of my monsters. Yeah, sorry. Okay, so what? Got all the numbers I'm looking at. Uh, is it? Hold on, what's that? Is it higher than CR six? No. Okay, does a Which... seventeen hit flat footed? Uh, flat footed. Which one? Uh, the one in the middle of the room. I can't no, see but one. EAC or KAC? E, uh, KAC. Flat footed does what to your AC? Minus what? Minus two, I think. I think it's the same regardless. Just hits. All right, then it takes 21. The top one? Yeah, this guy. Right, man. Oh my, oh my glob. They both equally look bloodied. Like, I don't know how y'all got them both to the same number. That's wild. <clears throat> Alright, that's me. Ouch. Florp? Oh, it's flat footed to everyone as well. Oh no, that's bad. Oh yeah. Okay. Um, well, see, I can only see righty from where I'm at. Good night. Uh, so I am going to. Love y'all too. Just good old fashioned get them. Colton, uh, close your eyes and go to sleep. Good old fashioned get them. Let me look up my stance. So it's just everyone gets a plus one against them to Mr. Brighty. Um, and let's see how many. No, go to bed. Let's see. Grand is tired only against all enemies who are within 60 feet. Oh, you know what? Um, are all the enemies within 60 feet of me? They sure are, Chuck. Okay. Um, at 6th level, which I am, you can spend a result no. to grant this bonus to attack rolls and dam damage rolls against all enemies who are within 60 feet oh, of me. So I'm going to go so ahead. They're both got them. And, and it's a two attack and damage now. Yes, yeah, so everyone gets a plus one to attack and damage against everything within 60 feet of me. Okay. Oh, dang. So, um, that is my move action, I believe. Yep, that's my move. And then for my full action, um, Obo, you wait. Who who has eaten some some damzoni? I know Obo is currently being chewed on. Yeah, I think I got hit too. Um, who's who is worse off? Because I can only see you two. So who looks like they've eaten more stam damn? I'm not bad at all, but I mean, yeah, I only took like twelve points of damage. Okay. Well, I think since Oboe is currently being sucked on 
and <laughs> injected. Yeah. Huh. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and give oboe. Uh, let's see, twice my Envoy level plus Charisma mod, so I believe I've got an 18, so that's 4 plus 14. So you think you get 18 stand back? Uh, cool. I only needed uh, half of that. <laughs> okay. Do you just, uh, just know that your Starfish has got your back? Appreciate it. Jesus, I'm gonna turn. Yep. And that's my turn. Vish. Vish. <clears throat> Vesh is going to take a guarded step. Schwa. <clears throat> and take a shot at uh, the one that's grappling. Now, does a guarded step, that's that's from any AOs, right? Yeah. I, well, I might just... Mm. But since that one's grappling... Oh. Anybody's flat footed can't take attacks of opportunity either. Mm -hmm. Ah! Oh. Curse you, rules. <laughs> no, it's good. Right, I can't Vesh remember these things. Take a shot. At so you could go further if you didn't want a five-footer. Mm. But I don't know if you'll lose no. your shot. Yeah. I'll stay right there. I'll stay right there. Um, smart. So smart. So it's a Can plus he one from Gotham? Plus one to attack and damage. And damage. Can we break the curse? Let's see. Yeah, <laughs> twenty-five is nice. it? Nice. Okay. My first time in like three sessions. Let's go. Two D four plus. <laughs> I'm not trolling. I'm really excited for you. <laughs> the amount of under tens you rolled was just astronomical. So that is eight fire damage. Plus one from the Gino. Uh, that is with the plus one. Oh, with the... Okay, okay. Keeping me honest. All right, all right. I like it. Uh, and then Theodore's going to mosey on into the room. Try and finish oh, this gun off. With his uh, already purchased weapon that he clearly had the entire time he was on this ship. Obviously, he already had it. <laughs> he was just sharpening it for a battle. He really needed it. <laughs> yes. It's like, uh, sir, it's a hammer. Why is he sharp? Don't ask questions. <laughs> He's sharpening the hammer. Uh, and plus one. Okay. On a side okay. note, right? Ooh. 24 to hit. Let me check the numbers. Yeah, that's a hit. Yeah. Right. Which one, the top guy? Uh, righty. Because that's righty. One, like, grappling oboe, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. That's definitely the one grappling oboe. All right. Let's see what we got here. Okay. 21 bludgeoning and cold damage. Ooh, let me check. Does he have any like vulnerabilities? <laughs> well, he's, he's got an immunity, but I don't think that's going to come into effect anytime soon. <laughs> How much total to righty? Uh, 21. 21? Yeah, plus oh. the, the 8 that Vesh did to him. So a total of 29 damage to righty? Yep. Well, I don't like that one bit. <laughs> He's not looking good. <laughs> you may save... Oh my god, and it's up to Dave. <laughs> Dave? Yeah? If there was ever a time to, sit, to save this giant lizard... I see. You always... Oh, wow. That's an ugly looking thing right there, huh? And it's just like slurping all over him. Magic missile! Magic missile! Okay. How many times? I think three, right? Oh, yeah. It says two. Let's go. Yeah. yeah, if you. Yeah. So that two force damage is a five? I think that's five each. Five each. 1d4 plus one per dart. Okay. Anything else, Dave? 
I cast magic missile into the darkness. It was good. Well, All right. Wait, okay. So one action. Is that two actions? Do I have another act? You do. Oh, I guess I'm just gonna shoot it. Oh God! Why the kid? What? Sorry, hold on. I'll be down there in one second. I'm done. I'm getting the belt, too. Get ready. Fucking ridiculous. Threaten these goddamn kids. Now I gotta put pants on. <laughs> we don't have to. I'm just trying to tie some voice with you running around there with your balls hanging out. No, no. Wouldn't mind that. Set them in my in-law's house. Traumatize them, too. Nope. Yeah, assert dominance. Keep it. <gasps> now, just to, just to, just to check, Mr. Carver, that wouldn't happen to be necrotic and plant damage, no? Yeah, you uh, you blow it out of the water. God damn it! What the fuck is plant damage? I don't know, but it's immune to it. I'll tell you that it's got plant. Damage. It's got plant immunities, whatever that means. Oh, plant immunities is. In the very back of the book, plants like mind affecting stuff or something. Yeah, yeah. stuff that wouldn't normally affect plants. Oh, mind affecting paralysis, poison, polymorph street, and stunning. Well, that's on you, Cliff. <laughs> yep. Just gonna, just gonna take that off real quick. All right. God damn it. These were extra well, plants. So Dave, like, slides over and, like, throws a magic missile and a shot at the same time, and, oh, it limps off of you, Obo. Does Obo look like they're glowing now? No, Obo's fine. Damn it. <laughs> first stop, first step. Look, I wanted it. First step of stress relief is to handle the stress problem, All right? Stop the stressor. <laughs> my job is done. Yeah. And thus, I will end my turn. Well, wait, I'll probably just scoop back here. There you go. There's something funny about a just a pretty android just walking up and just disintegrating something with like, like a dark right, like a was it a rot cannon or something? Yes. It's such a weird thing. I kind of need to look up what this weapon. It's a frailty rifle. Yes. Rock club. All right, Obo, what's the deal? What you doing? It's a rock club rifle. Thank you, Android Lady. I will move here and slice this plant thing. No, please. You murdered my brother. Oh, that's a hit. God damn it. Technically, I murdered him. Okay, lovely. Shit. Anything else, Obo? Uh, no, that's gonna be. We're gonna do it. Alright. It is going to attack Munchie. Oh, that's a miss. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and what's there's no like double damage in crit, right? It's just crit effects. Uh, that is double no. damage. I don't remember. Well, I've already messed up this whole encounter, anyways. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Remember, I, I think he has. You had to hit ten higher than his than his AC. So if he has higher than are you good? Is that Pathfinder 2E you're messing with over there? <laughs> yes, I think I am. Mr. Three Action Economy, I just gave you for no reason. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I was wondering why you give him two actions like that. I was like, all right. Yeah. Yeah. Realized after I did it. A little stressful <laughs> day, guys. Okay. All right. Critical. All right. Hit. 
It means you roll your damage twice and then add any additional abilities or whatever. Yep. I was oh, so D6 point? <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Fuck, of course. I need you to make a wisdom saving throw. Okay. okay. DC 19. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I spend uh, one resolve and it shifts the pain back to him. He felt so. I uh, reduced the damage by seven. So what was it? Twelve. Mm -hmm. So that brings it down to five, and he takes seven points of damage. <laughs> it's not looking good. However, you're grabbed. It is now trying to sink its. Gross barbs into your skittermander skin. <laughs> and at the beginning of your turn, I need a fortitude save. Twenty-five. Fuck. <clears throat> You're on it. Proceed to murder my plant. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. Not with a 12. No, no 12's not going to get that. <clears throat> Damn it. I'll botch this all to hell. Alright. It's my turn. Glib. E. Click, click. Wow. <laughs> was this? Oh, I didn't think it was the mid 2000s. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> click, click. <laughs> Here playing on the <laughs> radio. Twenty nine games. That's it. An ancient oh, sorry. sorry. <laughs> 30 damage. My macro doesn't count for get him doing damage. Yeah. Get that plus one Sony. Thirty damage. It's dead. <coughs> That was, as the kids say, boom headshot. 360 nose go. I don't, I don't oh, think you say that. I think it's just a shitty millennial. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Google it real quick. See if the kids say it. I don't know. Hey Siri, do the kids say it? <laughs> No. You fucking old man. <laughs> <laughs> Can I tell you all what the effect was? Yeah, sure. Uh, Impregnation. DZ. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> it says that any creature with an intelligence score, which already tells you it's bad, <laughs> that starts its turn grappled must succeed a fort save or progress one step down the intelligence poison track. Oh. In oh. addition, the sky sail regains a number of HP equal to the target's CR. Oh. Ooh, and checks to escape or minus two. But that would have been fun, but goodbye. Goodbye, plant. <laughs> goodbye forever. I mean, theoretically, whenever it lacks <laughs> to uh, Oboe, it really was probably... That was the best target group-wise to be hit with. Yeah. I know, and I biffed it. Started off stunned when I shouldn't have been. That's fine. Fine, I'm going to read my monsters next time. Don't worry. Okay. All right, so you're in this, you know, 1920 spaceship. You remember a science ship, and they were researching. Do y'all remember? Uh, it's been a while. Uh, well, you just, you, you just, you just. Oh, I'll wait. I'm guessing plants. All right. <laughs> I think it was genetic yeah. stuff, right? It was like a genetic research. Let's see. You're close. You're on the right track. Uh, they're researching kinky robot sex stuff. Oh, man. Did I write it down? Oh, I thought we just came up on this ship that was just drifting mindlessly. We came up to see what was going on. Hmm. <clears throat> 
because hold on, give me give me two seconds. Sorry, I got gotta whip the job. That fucking work bugging me. All right, come here. Uh, do we guys do we want to take a ten? Do you guys want a ten? Get some stand back. Damn Who is crying? Oh, God, guys, I'll be right back. Motherfucker. <laughs> um, I don't know. I'm only down 12 stamina. Okay, so I could just start giving everyone a who took damage a pep talk, get you some stand back, but then you can't get any stand back until we take a 10 minute break. I think that's fine. All right. Uh, I think it was just you, right? Just you took Stam Dam? Yeah, no. Well, I think Obo did too. Well, I guess you healed that. Yeah, I, I topped up Obo. <clears throat> Plus, yeah, he can't benefit me. from it again. Okay. Then, for the sake of us not taking a 10 minute break, <laughs> I will just come up and be like, hey, be careful next time. We care about you. And you yeah. get. I think it was what, 14? No, it was 14 plus four, so 18. You get 18 stand back. Oh, sick. And, but you can't benefit from a pep talk until you take a 10 minute rest. Anybody else? Probably Obo. Well, he already got the benefit of it. <laughs> yeah, no, uh, I, I, I'm full on health and stamina and everything. Though. Um, so Carver and Glib, no Stam Dam. No Stam Dam. I would actually have to have been there for most of the fight <laughs> to take damage. <clears throat> so have we gone over, like, your, you said your character is what, just like an androgynous, like, comfort android? Is it? No. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Didn't you say something about a comfort something just now? No, no, no! I didn't say that. I don't think I ever. Had. Okay. Well, what is your? What's your? Like, what's? What do you actually look like again? Or is this the anime girl in the picture? Oh, uh, I think there. Yeah. That's, what... That's pretty much it. And A two from near. Okay. No, is that uh, on the assumption that all humans look like anime characters, or do you specifically look like an anime person in a world with normal people? I don't think I look normal. Okay. <laughs> so definitely an Aslanti weeb education. <laughs> yeah. My wife. But I'm no, going to teach her to use guns. <laughs> Gun waifu. What I'm thinking is going to be, is, 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 it is, because I don't know. So technically, I don't think I have any memory prior to running into you guys. Right? And I know I got that, that armor piece, right? Yeah. I think that old boy sent me in there to kill a girl and try to have me brainwaved. Mm. Yeah, because yeah, I'm... Okay. But I never talked to Cliff about, hey, what's my background? That is a fun, a fun idea that you just like, you know what? I'm a trucker now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I like these guys. I'm a trucker now. Ooh, woo. Or, oh. or tech... <laughs> What happens if, if, if you know, instead I was actually sent over here to kill all you? Then you're doing a piss poor job. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It was the pancakes. <laughs> the worst part is you guys leave me alone in the bottom of the bowels of the ship right next to the computer stuff. Yeah, well. I literally could take over the computer anytime I feel like it. That's fine. But you haven't yet. You could you could have done your job and yet you haven't. So either you're the worst assassin ever, or you're playing the most incredibly long game ever <laughs> like i could just imagine you checking in with your boss like have you killed him it's like no why not <laughs> <laughs> because <Pancake>. fuck you because <laughs> tomorrow's pancake <laughs> wait what what do you mean pan <laughs> just hang up on him <laughs> it's like as long as i get my pancake fix you guys are safe <laughs> And it was that day that Munchie saved us all. <laughs> Without yeah. even knowing it, because all he goes was pancakes. <laughs> as long I'm as curious, are the pancakes you make, are they like standard, regular pancakes, or are they like 
future like protein infused all purpose all nutrition pancakes I like to think it's simple pancakes no simple buttermilk pancakes so it didn't have like fiber supplements and vitamins and well, protein you know, every once in a while i put the brains of the creatures we killed in them you know but you don't know this <laughs> it's just sausage sausage chunks yep it's the mcgriddle <laughs> yes munchie where'd you make this mcgriddle at <laughs> More like a McGristle. Ooh. Ooh. And I have to make sacks. So I have something regularly to throw at people. <laughs> you know? yeah. I literally have it written down. Pancakes every day to throw. Yeah, but could you imagine being like a, a highly trained like space soldier and then you just see like your compatriot have his space like his space helmet shattered and his brain explode because a pancake hit it so hard <laughs> we're like coming in like in the aftermath like what happened here and there's like the regular gunshots but then there's just a guy with like a pancake embedded in his skull <laughs> I'm, and it's... I'm, just, I'm just imagining some like some decently good artist's flash animation about just a guy on guard duty Sips coffee, looks at his uh, at the screens, and it's like our party just waltzing <laughs> through a place. Everything is just psychotic, and he's just like, "Fucking Mondays." <laughs> you know what? I'm I'm taking the day off early. I'm leaving early, guys. I'll see, you. I'll see you next week. <laughs> or it's like the guy's clocking out and walks past us, and he's just like, "You know what? I'm off the clock." <laughs> Y'all have fun. Turn me. You know what? This is like, all right, bud. See you tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> this is night shift's problem. Not my problem. <laughs> Bye, Ralph. Bye, Frank. I, I, I had to deal with the manager. They can deal with this. <laughs> That's one reason why I hate day shift. It's like all the managers and stuff are just walking around. Night shift, nobody gives a fuck. They're like, all right, as long as it gets done, just. Oh uh, man, I miss night shifts. Don't disturb me in my office. You won't like what you see. We gotta give David Karen a haircut and then unleash her. Coca. Oh, uh, that's what we had to do. Turn you into that freaking uh, mega Karen from that TikTok with those dudes in the uh, computer store. Oh, which one it is. Man, Cliff must be really just beating the shit out of his child. <laughs> Surprised we haven't heard anything through the mic yet. Yeah, well, he hasn't muted. Oh, that. I guess to prevent us from calling the police on it. <laughs> God. No, I don't think he's actually beating his child that much. There you go. That your much. humor. Oh god, that haircut. I can't I can't watch it. Just that haircut. These dudes are freaking hilarious. I know, but I feel like it brings up such visceral visceral reactions to all the all the original Karen's from back in high school. Like Miss Londine. Oh my god. Yeah. I feel so like that that is one reason why I pitied Zach Lundin. But it's same <laughs> his mom is <laughs> Yes, mom was awful. Oh, I think I told you about the day that she uh she like told our entire computer class about how he had explosive diarrhea. Really? Yes. Wow. Yeah, she told our entire and keep in mind he was like in middle school. And so what was it? There was like during a play or something because they would bring up like middle school kids to, to play children in the high school plays. No. And so he was in one and he was being a real shithead. So I was like, hey, Zach, your mom told everybody about that time you had explosive diarrhea and he just like ran off. Wow. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, that's like a fucking villain origin story right there. <laughs> yeah, well, I, I'm pretty sure he's married with a kid now, so he's doing all right. <laughs> He's fine. Isn't he a? Didn't he go into nursing or something? 
Yeah, I believe from last I heard, I think he's an ER nurse at Baytown Methodist. Okay. I think. I feel like Good. everyone I know either went into teaching or the medical industry. <laughs> well, um, no, not entirely. Casey's in oil and gas. I was in oil and gas for a while. Yeah. Which I'm going into medicine now. Yeah. Um, fuck yeah, oil and gas. Man, fuck oil and gas, man. Eh. I mean, no. Uh, it's. I'm I mean, done. I live. I live in Canada. There's a very. There's a slightly different v view set to it. Yeah. We're not polluting the ocean. We're just polluting the middle of nowhere. Yeah, I mean, you're. <laughs> yeah, you're not not polluting. <laughs> It's just uh, you're polluting places where people aren't at. But also tar, was it tar sands and stuff that they mine out of that place? Or just yeah, or... it's like the worst yield possible for as far as like actually expending energy to get oil out of the ground. Yeah, but, you, have I to, mean... you have to keep it boiling in order for it to move. And it's also super coarse, so it destroys every pipeline it's in. Um, it's just a, a mess to clean up. It's just, it's the worst crude oil you can get. Oh God. Yep. Yeah. I think it's to the point where like they'll pump, I think like clean, like crude oil from Texas up to Canada to, I guess, water down the oil sands to get, <laughs> the, to get it back down. <laughs> that sounds right. Yeah, it's like they have to get like the super high gravity stuff that's pretty much like you know, it like it'll it'll eat through any plastic and they have to send it up there to make the oil sands like you know, able to move through a pipe. <laughs> Oily. <laughs> yeah, so it's like, oh wait, so this is pretty much pure gasoline that comes out of the ground and we have to pump it up there to get a semi viscous sludge back. So great stuff. But uh, yeah, I just I'm just glad to get out of it because I was tired of all the the safety violations and stuff. That's... Uh oh. Oh god damn! What is this? It's classified yeah. materials from the uh... <laughs> from the from the bad guys. I forget where they are. The <laughs> Atlantic people. <laughs> yeah, we're lucky you're not activated. I guess. <laughs> now is this actual gameplay or is this somebody's fan yes it's gameplay okay but i'm guessing are the slowdowns actually in gameplay or is that them just trying to show off the i think well i could find another one no no i was just curious I wasn't sure if it was the fan who was slowing it down to be a creep or if it's the developers trying to appeal to creeps. Be like, hey, look at this sexy android. You know uh, <clears throat> yeah. Uh, developers will definitely... They're not appealing to creeps. They're just appealing to themselves. Unfortunately, yeah. they are also creeps. Oh, oh yeah, I mean, it's a... Uh... Like it, it's can... what the feminists are complaining about. <laughs> <laughs> Let me find the uh, the latest. What is it? Atomic Heart or some shit? Back. Oh, never mind. Sorry. Is your child still alive? Do we need to call the police on you? Oh, he's alive. It's just fucking. CPS is on route. The autistic one. He's in there fucking bawling his eyeballs out because it raised my voice. I'm like, dude, I asked you. 37 fucking times. <clears throat> God, what am I supposed to do besides beat your ass? So he's autistic, so I can't go in there that hot and heavy. Anywho, spooky spaceship of blood and plants from the 19 whatever the fucks. I like that what? movie. Oh yeah, it was pre-gap too, wasn't it? Oh, it was a, uh, it was, it was around the gap at least. It was immediately. It was like, it was basically gap. Yeah. 
It's like they left with pre-gap stuff, and then the gap happened, and they lost all their maps. <laughs> so what do you mean Galarian's not there anymore? <laughs> <laughs> Bullshit. Turn the ship around. You're lying. <laughs> oh, shit. It's not there. There's just a big-ass space station. <laughs> well, <laughs> I guess my family's dead. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Betty. You always wanted to fuck, right? Right, Betty? No. Or to like a crew member. <laughs> you said you hated your mom, right? <laughs> I got good news! Alright. So you're on a spooky spaceship. Yes. Okay, we definitely detected life signs. Do we think this is the life signs we detected? <clears throat> I don't know. Uh, Can I roll another perception check to use my <coughs> wine sense? <coughs> mm hmm. <clears throat> All right, let's see. Was that like a once a day thing, or I don't think so? I just have blind sense. Just a walking fucking weird cockroach radar now. Yeah, gross. Insects. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what are you gonna do? I rolled an eighteen to check this room out thoroughly. And 18. Um, so this uh, was a like a like a bio lab, and it's it's just been overran by plants. There's no more hostile plants, but there are some herbs. The cooking herbs, not the smoking herbs. Ah. Can we combine the red and green into a new herb that? Restores HP. <laughs> <laughs> Not today. <laughs> All right. So, cooking herbs. How many? I uh, will say, like, you could probably sack up like a pound of them. Are there eleven herbs and spices? There might be eleven. Woohoo! KFC. Here I come. <laughs> Space KFC. Skittermander fried chicken. <laughs> Absalom fried skitter, Mander. Hey, isn't there a race that's supposed to be really tasty? I don't remember. I think you're thinking of Futurama. No, there's actually one that's actually, and they said that they taste really good. Well, I guess now I have to look it up. <laughs> <laughs> the Start rabbit hole. Tasty race. Alright, what? Do you oh. want to do now? Hmm. We salvage this engine thing in here. In there was the botany lab, and oh, okay. in this room, yeah. Okay, time out real quick. There is a race called the Goron. Um, that they oh, have, you know what? Go ahead. They have a stat. They have like a racial ability called Delicious. They take a minus two penalty to attack rolls and acrobatic checks to escape a grapple against a creature that uses a grab ability with a bite natural weapon. <laughs> so, yeah. You said they're Gorons? Gorons. Mm. G-H-O-R-A-N. I see. They're like plant people. I see. You are right. I did say there was an engine here kind of feeding the plants. <laughs> so, if given enough time... You want to spend time disassembling it, you might be able to find some chunks that might benefit the ship. That might be helpful. Yeah. I mean, they're not using it anymore, right? I yeah. Time in here. Oh. Chilling. Wow. I was gonna say also, I don't know if it I can't I don't think it shows it on the map, but there are there are doors in this room. Yeah. Oh. Okay, it does show okay. Well you're gonna do what now with the what? I'll just spend time in here. However much time it takes while you guys <sighs> explore, explore some other stuff. That's like a like a two hour gig. Yeah. All right. Oh. Munchy stealthing about, looking. Some with them. Um, if we're gonna split up, do we want to split up in like pairs so at least nobody's alone? Yeah. I'm just following Munchy so he doesn't get into more cupboards. <laughs> okay, so we lost about you. Oh no. You're 
You hear like rattling around. <laughs> it's kind of funny the idea of Munchie like skittering along the ground and then just this lizard skittering on the roof. You just blasting through walls and doors, huh? Was it locked? <laughs> you you gonna ask before you bust through it? <laughs> I busted the door. Is it locked? No, it's not locked. Well, if it's gonna take that long, I'll. Uh, there's what looks like with blood over there, buddy. The rest of the ship. Yeah. All right, let's probably let the others know we found blood trails. We taste the video. That bloody hallway. We also found the bathroom. If you, if you need to poop, search for drugs behind the toilet. <gasps> Ooh, roll me a perception check. <laughs> Is there a search? If outer wa if outer worlds has taught me anything, <laughs> outer worlds was such a fun game. I love that game. I gotta finish it. It's fun. It is also funny to watch the speed runs of the game. Well, say so you find like a little gram of something, you're not really sure what it is. <laughs> is this Physical blood science. fresh or old? Physical science. Say again? Is the blood fresh or old? Uh, fresh. Ooh, fresh. All right. I think we walk in here and we're like, oh, this is a, this is some interesting stuff going on. And then you're well, like, y'all do y'all do remember like the bloody entrance too, right? Yeah. yeah. But yeah, I guess if there's fresh blood, we should probably make sure there's not space raptors on here. <laughs> you know how Damn. dangerous those things are. Space raptors, clever there, girl. There is actually a race in the game that is like little velociraptors. Oh. I was almost at that race. It was between that and the the ones that are just like a a, a little cone on a ball. We were radioed to uh, fresh and blurt that we found more fresh blood in the hallway. All right, wait, which? So I don't walk into something I'm not supposed to. <laughs> Where are you guys? Yeah. Do east. up here and then to the right. Yeah, so forward. to go east oh, okay. from the town and then up and east. Found you. Okay. I don't want to walk into something and clip be like, oh, what is that you're walking into? All right, all right, <laughs> all right. All right. Here's the bathroom, right. but we haven't checked this door out yet. But right, but you does definitely the blood look like it's coming from this door and going north, or from north going to <laughs> south to this door? Going from north to the east. All right. And anybody that gets within 10 feet of the door, let oh me know. Uh, I think everybody. <laughs> everybody? Oh. I need a will save from everyone. What? Oh, oh I am. I'm at the back of the hallway, sir. I'm 15 feet away. Thank you very much. Yes. I just wanted to know if someone was 10 feet away. Everyone's still got to make the save, <laughs> baby boy. Oh, oh man. You said a will save? I did. Oh, you're you're I William, know. right? You're William McStarfish. Not as much. <laughs> A modest modifier. See? Oh boy. Okay. Uh anyone that's below fifteen or fifteen or below is just like they kinda have like a static feeling in their brain. Their vision gets a little blurry. Anyone above is unaffected. And for like the purposes, y'all are kind of like stunned for a moment. Uh, the ones that saved, 16 and above, mm -hmm. you hear a voice. I'll say, um, is this considered a fear effect? Uh, not in the terms of the spell. Maybe <laughs> it might scare the shit out of your character, but no. Well, Not a fear effect. Well, the, oh, because well, the reason the I made a 15, but I mean, I get plus two if it's a fear effect. So I, it depends if I save or if I don't. Uh, yeah, sure, why not? Um, okay. Here's another question. Uh -huh. Which I don't think it'll affect it too much because it would only be a plus two, I think. But. Is this a saving throw against a death effect, disease, mind effect, uh, paralysis, poison, sleep effect, and stunning effect? Yes. 
Okay, so that means I have an 11. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you still can't hear or feel or see anything. Uh, yeah, so you all hear a voice saying, Why are you on my ship? To make pancakes? Everyone hears it, or just the people who are just the people that saved? Not... Okay. Yeah. Do we hear it like in our heads, or do we hear like yeah. a voice? Oh, okay. it's in your heads. Oh, I hear funny voice in head. Everyone that fails is actually seeing like visions of like strange, like a strange civilization. Don't really recognize the buildings or the clothing. Uh, I'll say to the voice. Uh, we didn't know. We we're just travelers. Thought we'd pop in and check on everyone. Oh, how kind of you. He's all being nice. I'm like to make pancakes. <laughs> <laughs> well, I assure you, we are fine. You need pancakes? We got lots of pancakes. Let me see. Does it eat? Google, tell me. Hmm. Ecology. Give me a cell. It does eat, but not pancakes. Oh, oh, oh God. Uh, yeah, no, uh, yeah, no, we're good. Uh, does anybody want to share what year it is? <laughs> uh, yeah, 2,573,632. I'm sorry. You said two, two million. million. Yes, million. No. Oh. With an M? Yes. M mm. for Munchie? <laughs> no, M for million. Jesus, you can't have years of Munchie. Not with that attitude. <laughs> you sure you want no pancakes? Mm. Fine. You come in. <laughs> and the door opens. <laughs> Hold on. Terrible dramatic reveal because overlays and shit. Hold on. No, it's not what I said. Go to the other layer. Yes. And then do this. And... Ah! Ew. I don't know. Is that a sexy blob? I don't know. Look in Discord. You tell me. He looks like a rat. Uh. Hmm. I don't know if that is a sexy blob or oh. not. It seems like a horny blob, but not a... Sorry, he should be like this. Sorry. Oh, jeez. That's a lot of pancakes you're going to eat. I hope you brought enough batter. <laughs> oh, I got plenty of them. What are you? Looks like he's a zergling. <laughs> What'd you call me? I think he said he called you a whatchamacallit. That's our word. <laughs> you look <laughs> like... Only we can say that. Get up! <laughs> you look like human this is what I am. Stalker. I am called an e Illigoth. The Illigoth? Where are you from? Uh, I, you know, at one point, I knew. I don't remember anymore. You ever thought about joining a bunch of truckers and hot rodding through space and just get into shenanigans? No, I must, I must get this ship. You must I get must the get... ship? Yes, I must. Sorry, cut you off there. You have the ship. <laughs> <laughs> I have it! Mission successful! <laughs> yeah! See, now you can come travel the universe with us. Now, mind you, like, these telepathic conversations, if you, like, listen to the sounds, it's like bellowing air coming from its stomach. It's awful. Uh, I don't know. It's I'm just trying to keep them talking so the other guys can shoot them, but they haven't taken the hit oh. yet. <laughs> uh, well, then I'll just keep talking then. So, yeah, the other day. <laughs> no, wait. I've got to get this ship back to... Uh... Hold on. I'll tell you in a second. Just, we, were, we were on a mission to find a new planet, and uh, it's uh, been a while. Um, what type of planet? Uh... Hab habitable. Well, I mean, what's habitable to you? 
I just, you know, like Galarian. Mm. Well, I I give him directions I saw on the map to the Nazi homeworld. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> yeah, yeah but... they'll love you. You can eat all of them, cause yeah, they don't, <laughs> yeah, just eat them. Well, I don't really like alive things. Oh, well, kill them first, then eat them. Nobody miss them. All right, before he just starts being chums with y'all, because <laughs> uh, fuck all that noise. Um, <laughs> no, I think this is going great. I mean, it's it's not going bad, <laughs> but I'm gonna need some checks from some people, right? Mm. Let me what, see. Free of the brain fog yet? Uh, I'll say yeah. Y'all are free of the brain fog. Absolutely. Once the door opened, y'all are okay. absolutely like, oh, look at that. That's <laughs> that's a uh, it's really gross. Love me. <laughs> Anywho, yeah. Uh, ooh, nope, not a fucking clue. <laughs> So we're doing knowledge checks, or do you want me to roll uh, diplomacy to make friends uh, with this guy? Uh, well, either one. The mystics and we'll see if I can figure out what an helicoth was, but yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I'll, I'll try rolling. I only have a plus six, but... <laughs> Let me know real quick whether we want yeah. to be friends with this or not. I mean, we don't want... I mean, if we could just send him <laughs> to the Atlante homeworld, I think that's good enough. Yeah, we'll fix your engine, and you can just... Fly there and eat as many Nazis as you want. Yes. <laughs> it's like a buffet. Yeah, just if they're wearing um, a military uniform, just eat them right up. But not us. <laughs> oh, anybody else for some checks on this guy? Uh, What was this? Speed mysticism or life science? Mysticism. Mysticism. I can... Roll with a plus one zony. Let's let's see if any that nat twenty will roll. Nope. I mean, you still rolled better than I did. But uh, I don't have a bonus. <laughs> Carver over there, like Munchie, how'd you forget about these guys? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, God. Oh. Okay, so he eats zombies. And ghosts. Whoa. That's fucking wild. That's cool. Does he kill them, or does he just kind of, like, suck the juice? I think he, like, erases them. Oh. Oh, are these from Eox? Huh. Hmm. On one hand, I'm not sure. I feel like we just leave him, leave him here on this ship, and he would, he just eat those plant guys when they come back. I mean, when they come back, what are you talking about? You literally said earlier, you let it slip, but they come back. So, well, I mean, the very first one says these guys no longer eat vegetation. Yeah, but it says they can suck in, suck vital energy from other creatures, so they don't physically eat them, but they like suck the the energy out of them. So I guess he just eats. Hey, I'm just saying that four. What was it? What? Five out of six of us have vital life energy. <laughs> I don't know. Well, either so, way. So yes, are we doing pancakes and brunch, or snapping of the necks? I'm saying if you if you're looking for a world, we can. So the directions I gave you is a perfectly world for you to go make a new home out of. Let you me look. Them. And he, he clickety-clacks with all his little clicky clackers <laughs> uh, And if y'all remember, 
Nazi planet was a dual star, right? And so. a constant dance with itself. Wow. I think it was binary suns. Binary suns? No, no, no. Binary planet. Okay. I see nothing. Can y'all see it? No? No. Can y'all drag your... Hold on. I can see my token when I drag it on. That's it. We do it with the dragon token on to see. Yeah, it didn't work. It's fucking Jose. Yeah, it's fucking Jose. Hold on. Hi. Hi there, Jose. Just uh, seeing how the campaign's going. Oh, you know. They're currently talking to the thing in Discord. Let's see if I do this. Oh. There we go. Whoa. That's the Eddie's Home World? Sure is. That's Home Worlds. Weird. The dual That's governmental system. That's, That's why they're so cranky. Their, their planets look like testicles. Right? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Or boobs. <laughs> yeah. Can you imagine traveling from one to the other via ocean? <laughs> it's a wild trip. It's the only way you can travel because the gravitation. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm disappointed it took you so long, to be honest with you. It's a dick in the butt. It's a dick in the butt. Baby. All right. So he goes, Oh, this. There are quite a few lovely life forces on this planet. Oh, look at this one. This one's. Hmm. I will accept your coordinates. <laughs> but, god damn it. Get off my map, you <laughs> monsters. I'm gonna go to the rest of super quick. God, it's just, it's just so many, so many bad images. Like, my kids can never watch me play this. <laughs> they shouldn't. What are you talking about? I made I love this game. He's that like, Dad, are you going to kill him with that thing? He's like, no, not yet. And probably not. Yeah. All right. So the plan is to give him the coordinates and then what? Just GTFO? So, yeah. You, you, you got anything else on this ship you need fixed? No, I think the engine will do. I f might be able to drive her faster than the speed of smell. Yeah, that, that kind of sucks traveling at the speed of smell, especially when Carver farts. You really want to run faster. It's gross. I mean, you know, I I gotta count my blessings. I can at least see stars. I can't tell you how long it's been. It's been nothing but constant crazy colors. You think, oh, cool? Sounds like a cool trip, bro. Yeah. Until it gets to, like, year 257, and it's just driving you fucking mad. Well, you know, you're not that far from a new home, so good luck. Mazel tov. Shut the door. Oh, do you, do you have any stuff that you don't need? I was going to ask if you had any stuff he didn't want, and then we could just take off his hand. No, I want it all. Oh, okay. Yeah. You know what? No. No, I don't have anything. Okay. So he's just gonna hang out in there. He's not gonna walk us out. He's just no. I, 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 I like it here. It's it's nice. Okay. Well, we're gonna. I know where you're at. It's fine. Okay. Uh, so I guess we'll just leave. <laughs> now he's doing flips. 
be so happy. Oh. I've got a new planet. <laughs> this door lock. We're happy for you. Oh, uh, what was, was the name of the guy who uh, we were fighting in the last place? It was Solon. Yeah, uh, Solon so... Ulavestra. Yeah, so I'll, I'll pop my head in real quick and say, "Hey, uh, whenever you start eating people, tell them that Ula or yeah, Ulavestra Ula Vestra Solon uh, sent you." Sure. Yeah. Well, do need it for you to come to their planet and just eat. Yeah. This is going to be so much fun. <laughs> yep. Haven't been this happy in like 20,000 years. Wow. Uh, and just, I, oh, I guess I should pop and ask, can you read? <laughs> uh, are you just trying to be rude now? Well, no, I mean, <laughs> I don't know if you do things in like a holistic way and you don't need reading. Yeah, it's not really something I... Why? I was going to say, we could, since I think you've been trapped in the drift forever, you could we could leave you some some books that we downloaded off the internet. You know. Maybe like all all 30 seasons of Jersey Shore or something. Okay. Give them War and Peace. Bro, the third season of The Wire? <laughs> 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 Yeah, you know so how hard that thing is to find. <laughs> yeah, so we we upload all all the seasons of The Wire to his, uh, yes. his computers before we leave. <laughs> yes. Cool. <laughs> Sick. Super tight, tight, tight. And then we put all the seasons of Twin Peaks, uh, but we don't include the movie. We do include the eight, the, the Showtime show, so he doesn't really know what's going on in the Showtime. Show. <laughs> You're a monster, Curly. <laughs> You're the real villain of this entire freaking campaign. Oh, wow, I've heard really good things about Twin Peaks. Is that all of it? And I'm like, <laughs> probably. <laughs> like, I think so. You know, the Nazis aren't all bad all the time, but you, sir, <laughs> you. Leave a wake of terror everywhere you go. In <laughs> as long as you remember that Zolan Ulavestra gave you this TV show. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Where are y'all heading? Uh, elsewhere. We're just passing mm. through. We're mm. truckers. Of course. You're just trucking by, right? Yeah. Yeah. And feed people pancakes. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. <laughs> Can Theodore peek in this door right here? Is... Uh, give me one second. All right. Where, 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 where you be? Theodore's right here. Oh, yeah, yeah. You can take a little, little peek. A little peek through. It's the kitchen. Yeah. What? Kitchen? <laughs> he goes, <laughs> faces through the wall. <laughs> oh, yeah, man. This is this is some retro stuff. I need this. I need that. 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 I need this. I'm ready to leave. leave. <laughs> I don't know what I grab. I just come out all six arms are full. <laughs> all right. Anything else on this lovely ship? Um, I mean, I don't want to piss this thing off. Yeah. So, like, I feel like we kind of, by, you know, saying, okay, we're leaving, we can't, like, toss the rest of the place. <laughs> So, you mean the thing that Munchie literally just did? <laughs> yeah. I mean, within okay. seconds, <laughs> almost <laughs> one would say, almost right in front of the thing. <laughs> he don't eat anyways. He don't want. Does this he stuff. value any of this stuff? Can we ask him? Like, 
Uh, are you particularly attached to anything on this ship? I love this ship. But like Every the... inch of it. Oh, well. But not, not the ship like that. Every piece of the ship. Well, what a coincidence. We're stealing you too. <laughs> Was that the fucking Roomba? <laughs> Yes, we we offer. Uh, yes, we're giving you the room. of diplomacy. Yes, you're gonna have the Roomba. Yeah, it'll clean your ship for you. I don't know. He, he's also friendly to talk to. Yes. And you can kick him. You can you could put an iPod on him so like he plays music when he. <laughs> <laughs> All right, where y'all going? Um. Well, he he clearly doesn't want us looting his ship. Like, <laughs> feel free to look around. I just uh, just don't you know, stealing's bad, right? No, yeah, no. stealing's yeah. bad. Sure. <laughs> Are there any uh, other occupants of this ship, or is it just you? Oh, yeah, it's just I'm the only one, no one, no one to talk to. Cool, cool, cool. Super cool, yeah. No, it's the best. <laughs> the bee's knees. Can I roll sense motive on this guy to see if we invited him on our ship, if he would try to eat us? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. He will eat you. He, I, he's probably the, the hottest thing you've seen ever. He's best. I, you have no idea. He's hard to read, right? He's a crazy, <laughs> cynical, floating abomination. Carver pretty much told us he needs life force. So there's only us on our ship. Oh, and our two dummies. And the engineer guy. Yeah. And the slugs. Yeah, if we alternate them, he can juice one, and then we'll replace them with the next one while they regain their vitality back. Yeah, I don't think so. That sounds like a morally good idea. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Literally do what you saw the Nazis doing in the previous few episodes, yeah. <laughs> yep. Mm. Human fucking batteries, why not? <laughs> All right, are we going to look around the ship or leave? Hey, what's up, Avery? Uh, uh, yeah, we're chilling, playing some D and D. Figure out by. I, I don't really talk a lot sometimes we, during these, but yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. I guess let's keep looking around. Pretty cool. And gather more can't... info. See if um, we can figure out why there's blood stains on the floor. Maybe it turns out this guy's a violent sociopath, or maybe he's a right refugee. Or oh, uh, thirty-five to hear what's going on on the other side of this door. Uh, I'm gonna a violent sociopath, which is a natural twenty. I'm literally listening to the future of the world. Uh, you hear the end of everything. <laughs> it's right, deafening. to see here. Bye, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Munchie snaps his own neck. All right, uh, you hear with that perception what sounds like a liquid moving and then, like, just, like, junk. Like, you know, just like your hand and, like, a, like a, Toolbox full of shit. Gotcha. So the mm. liquid moving sounds like blurp in his natural state going to a toolbox. That's what you tell me? Yep. It's like blurp digging through a toolbox. I tell blurp, uh, there's somebody like you over here digging in a toolbox. <laughs> uh, I knock politely at the door. Hello? No, no answer. Hello? Oh, well, well, I open the door. What's in there? It is a hallway covered in bits and baubles of just metal and blood. Just like... Uh, sounds like a job for Obo to go first. <laughs> Fine, if Obo Zaya must. Okay. Real quick, while you guys are doing that, I want to run back to the entrance to our ship and make sure there's nothing weird. Uh, 
I guess this is where it meets up with. Obozaya uh... sees Carver's cousin on the ground. Yeah. Don't tell that, Obo. Is the door to our ship, like, is the door still locked behind us? It is locked. Okay. Um, you, this pe you peer the in, place. and there is, uh, maybe perception. Okay, I got the perception of plus seven zoni. Oh, hold on, y'all walk through that whole hallway? Hold on, hold on, hold on. He said while y'all check that hallway... I'm just running through shit. I can't see the big ass map. There's too much. Well, I mean, we just moved a little bit, and I know. we can see it just went back to a room we'd already been in. So we I just thought we'd join them. <laughs> all right, all right, fair enough. Uh, perception. All right, Obo. When you're about right there, so y'all can be where you were behind Obo, where you want to be. So you see inside this airlock, there's a hole. What do you mean there's a hole? Like, there's no pressure and there's a hole in the airlock. I mean, like, there's like the ship isn't there or just the airlock? No, like, there's like, it, so as you peer into it, it looks like actually something passed through it very fast. Like something. Like an asteroid or something, like, blew through each side. Oh, okay. But our ship is still on the other side? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I want to radio the idiots. Mm hmm, mm hmm. And, uh, all right, radio. <laughs> all right, hey, guys. It's your captain speaking. Hey, yes, sir. Uh, how's it going over there? Uh, 10 for all nominal. Now, are you sure about that? I'm going to give you a chance to... to... <laughs> To revise what, the answer. Which 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 systems are you really interested? In? Oh, what is that? That's uh, it. I'm eating the brains when we get back. <laughs> no, well, it says you... it just like it just happened. If if it's any, I I just did one one handstand, and this is what I get. What what has just happened to you? I... Tell me what. How long ago <laughs> was just? <happened? laughs> Well, there was, uh, there was my vocal warm-up, <clears throat> then my, you know what, it's been about ten minutes. Uh, Look, the plaza side is, is you can still pass through it, there's just no atmosphere. You'll be fine! You, you know, hmm. Now, can you just do me a solid and make sure that nothing has tried to crawl into the ship? Because remember, I told you guys, uh -huh. watch the door. Yes, always. Oh, let me... But real quick, real quick. And then I want to call the robots that we left on the ship. <laughs> and I want to check with the robots. <laughs> <laughs> the robots were to life and scare the shit out of the dudes. Oh, God! <laughs> uh, so, yeah, after a thorough scan of the ship, uh, there, there's nothing, nothing has boarded your vessel. There's no sign of entry. All, the whole of your ship's fine. It's just okay. something passed through the airlock. Do right. you mean I, I can't eat your brains now? Damn it. Mm, not yet. We need them for the guns. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and at that point. Oh. Yep. Oh, well, my friend with the blood leech. Oh, but remember, she has a husband and family at home that she left. <laughs> uh oh, <laughs> the lore, the lore thickens. <laughs> uh, let me just show y'all what this looks like up close on Discord for you, real fast. There you go. Ew. That. Yeah. Oh yeah. It is gross of the highest order. How big is it? Uh, bigger than a bread box? Hold on. Oh. About the size <laughs> of a bread box. How many bread boxes? Uh, they are considered large. 
Oh, oh wow. So a scale me, of one to ten. Let me just. So does it mean they take up ten by ten? Yeah. Oh. Okay. On a scale of one to ten, how many bread small. boxes are they the <laughs> okay, size there of? There we go. Uh, let me also reveal the other bad thing that's happening. We're not supposed to have bad things. You hear something slam against the door, Borgelberg. Oh no! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Get you that little photo. Oh, it's bad. That is so hot. That is also in Discord. <sighs> Wait, how is that possible? <laughs> hey, plus two. I should be in. Fred? Yeah, it's Fred. What? Oh. Oh. All he right. Like Man, Fred and the slugs inside. rode zeros. What'd you say? A roommate? He looks like a roommate coming out of his room to get a snack. Like, oh, hey, guys. Hey, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> the one who definitely works nights all the time, so you only work <laughs> yeah. like, Oh, hey, guys. Sorry, don't mind me. Yeah, you guys keep playing. I'm fine. Don't worry, I'm a heavy sleeper. It's fine. It's cool. <laughs> <laughs> but, like, you don't know if he's being passive-aggressive or not, or if he's <laughs> just kind of an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> but he pays on time, so you just kind of. <laughs> All right, I think we're waiting on one initiative. M Mrs. Oh, there she is down there. Bow. All right. This fucking thing. It's going to roll an engineering check. Hey, zombies can roll engineering? Oh boy, can it. Oh, is this some kind of like fucking undead engineer or something? Oh. What the fuck? Boy. All right. The light shut off. It's not good. And... Nope. Nope. It's not what I said. Yeah. And he's going to... Just move a little closer. I don't know if you have night vision, but if not, all you can hear is him breathing next to you. No, I have 60 feet of dark. Did we right. do the shopping? Is that retconned in? Shopping was retconned. Nice. I have night vision scope. That sounds even worse than just not seeing them. Is only seeing them in the scope. Oh, my heart. All right. So, yeah, not only the lights go out, we'll talk about what happens later. Sca scavenge slime time. Let's see here. What does he do? Well, let's look up this real quick before I go fucking up the game. All right, I'm just going to keep that up for later. Mm -hmm. No, for real? That's... Yes. Diamond's laser. What the fuck? What the fuck's <laughs> happening? <laughs> laser wolf? Hell yeah, I don't even know what it is, but I'm for it. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, whether she literally gave it to me last session. <laughs> Laser wolf. Oh, you gotta look up all that stuff. That you're joking. Does it? You're summoning this thing, huh? Not yet. I mean, it's not even my turn, but. Oh. I was oh, trying to see what it did and hit the wrong button. Well. 
Alright, so here it goes with this slime. Spoilers, it's a slime. It does. It's going to... If I shoot in melee, do I get negatives? Yes. yes. I think so. Doesn't it provoke? I thought so. Well, then I'm not doing that. Wait, which one is going? Which one is it? Oh, it's that one. Yeah, he's not doing that. All right, so we'll just do a solid pseudopod attack. Right? Easy. To... Obo. Full attack, the second one's at minus two, right? Uh, I think it's minus four. All right, does a 22 get you Oboe? Pretty sure it doesn't. Alright, we'll say it doesn't retro cause some damage if it happens. Glip! Glip, you're, you're surrounded by a slime! Slime in the ice machine! <laughs> Are we fighting Marvin Zindler's ghost? Marvin, Marvin Zindler! <laughs> I witnessed, you know, I did a pet rock project in junior, uh, junior high for that guy. I made a little. I made a. Yeah, dude, it was awesome. I gave him a wig, glasses. It had like the ABC channel backdrop behind it. It was awesome. Wow. I will Can... shoot the one that's on Lunchy. Shoot my slime. Do your worst. Uh, my worst, eh? Your worst. Do it. Twenty-four damage. What was the the to hit? Twenty-eight, and it's flat-footed. Okay. Smarty pants. Sorry, yes. I see. I see big numbers. I assume the best. Oh, do you? You forget who's running this game, sir? No, I'm just joking. Hold on. I'm just... Oh, Munchie is clearly running this game. I, I thought that was pretty clear. Yeah, you're right. Uh, how much damage? 12? 24. To which one? Uh, the one that's on Munchie. One that's on Munchie. All right. Okay, now I can't see the thing I just did. Mother. There it is. All right. Cool. All right. Davey, what do you do? <laughs> the so there's slime. one behind us and one in front of us, huh? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Yeah, I didn't see the one behind us. But I asked which one, Glamp? You know, in character. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> in, person, I'm, in person, I am very scared of the one behind me. <laughs> uh, I'm going to try this. As a third level spell. Three. What the fuck? That's some nasty shit, dog. What level? Three? At level three. So that's three attacks at 5d6. Wow. Okay. Which looks like it did 14 points of damage for each fill. And they just hit? It just hits, huh? I guess so. Fuck me. So what's that? 42 damage? <laughs> Looks like it. Make sure I'm reading all this right. Thirds. Yeah, 3, 5d6. No, it's just 5d6. Oh, yeah, I know. Ouch. Is that right? It does it three times? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Okay. I'm not <laughs> calling you a liar. Just, oof, rough. Ooh. 
Alright, so the total was 42 damage, yeah? Yep. Uh, I'm seeing on archives, it says there is a saving throw. Reflex for half? Probably. <sighs> Keep them honest. Do I not have them on here? I don't, it doesn't show it on the thing. I don't know why. The spell penetration. Um. God. Ah, sorry. It should have been a plus four. I don't know why it was nine. It's still so 22. 22. Still be this DC. Yeah. It's okay. Okay. You still did damage. It was a lot of fire damage, though. 21. Okay. Okay. All right. It's turn. Yeah, buddy. So you see this thing like slurp around and out pops an artillery laser. Whoa. From just like inside of all of its nonsense, right? <laughs> and we're going to go. Who popped him? The mage popped him, huh? It's going to shoot the mage. Yeah, the second one's a 16. First one will hit, second one will miss. Are you taking a minus four to both of those? Minus four to the first one, too? E yes, you can spend a full action to make two attacks each with the minus ah, four penalty. The 23 still hits? I'm oh, sorry, uh, so 15 and 16. No, 19 would hit. Oh, then fuck me. <laughs> All right, blow up your up. Okay, so this guy opened the airlock. Did it immediately suck all the air out of the room? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, uh, um, if you want, you can make me an engineering check to see what he did. Sure, I'll I'll do a free engineering check. I mean, just. Yeah, I'll see if you can figure out what button he just pressed because the light shut off. Oh my. It's only 12. All right, yeah, I have no idea. Turn off the lights. Uh, well, I mean, I can still see him. Um, well, uh, presumably, as this is happening, I'm like, oh god, this undead guy just opened the door <laughs> on open radio <laughs> frequency. Um, that goes to everybody in here and our idiots on the ship hmm. so hopefully they realize oh maybe we should put our bullshit down and grab the guns just in case um and then i guess i guess what i've heard any of this combat that's happening uh yeah there was some definite fire explosions going on for sure okay well like uh three of them to be exact <laughs> Okay, well, uh, you know, I'm going to go, I would full withdraw, but I feel like I would be better off if I just did a regular move. I'll take, regular the, move, John? take the AOO and I'll move up to this hallway so I can see what the hell. Um, the whole time I'm yelling, oh, the airlock's open, masks up, boys. Um, well, actually, hold on, is this door open? Like this one right here. Which one? Sorry, I'm. This one right uh, here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I'll so, delete it. No, well, no. I'm just asking: is it unlocked or is it open? Uh, it is. It's unlocked. Sorry. Okay. So sure. as yeah. of now, the air hasn't been sucked out of that room. No, nope, but you can feel it pouring. Okay. Well, I mean, so just to be sure. Is the air just being sucked out of the ship in general, or is it currently just this room is depressurized? You can feel like just right now it's just this room. You can't really tell for the whole ship. Okay. 
to um, be able to tell. In that case, I don't, I don't know, because I guess are we under the assumption that all of us have our fucking spacesuits on? I thought we did, because it was like... Well, we had to, to come over here. Yeah. That's why I'm just making sure, so that way I don't want to depressurize and be like, oh no, I, I gotta breathe. So. Yeah, I think we all did, because life support wasn't an on, right, when we came on the ship. Yeah, I think so. Okay, cool. So, then I will just move normally, get right up there. So I can see what the hell's going on. Uh, I'll take the AOO. Mm -hmm. I'm just and, looking at something real quick. And, uh... Yeah. Can I grapple as an AOO? Uh... I think it's just a combat maneuver. Uh, let's see. Attack opportunity. Uh, I think it's just you can make an attack. I think combat maneuvers are... Uh, um, I don't know if they can't. As a standard action, you can attempt to make one of the following combat maneuvers. So it's does not listed as an attack. So unless you have a, a feat, I guess. Or unless your attack grabs. No. All right. So it's just going to stab you with this tactical knife. Okay. Ha -cha -cha -cha! Whoa. Alright, so yeah, a 22 hits my KAC. Because I haven't installed any of my upgrades. What? But if you bought them... Well, I'm gonna... Because I don't want to have to deal with it right now. So I'll just say that I was like, oh, I don't need them right now. So they're still in my bunk, like in the packet. They're still mint in box. Oof. Max is that, damage. Is that piercing damage? That is... Yeah, slashing, yes. Okay, well, I do have DR5 to all physical damage. All so right. That, Not so bad. That, it's only eight. I only eight. Yeah, Could be fine. worse. It's fine. Gentleman's eight. Eight damn Zoni. So he, he slashes at me. I'm like, oh, fuck. And I just <sighs> go up here. Um, so that's my move action. And then I see there's, uh -huh. what, two giant slug beasts in here? It's like a, like a blood ooze mixed with a bunch of just technology. Oh, uh, do I think that these slugs uh, are affected by mind affecting? Uh, they might be. Mm. Then I will go ahead and just use clever faint on the closest one. What is it like right here? Like okay, here. yeah. I don't know. Can yeah, I guess that guy. So I'll use clever faint on him. So you got to do a bluff check. Old ready, and that's against my. Uh, okay, so I have to pull up the faint rules again. I don't see any of his like. He has no pluses to any of the charisma stat stuff. So it's probably okay, going to so be the CR thing. This is uh, ten plus the sense motive. Or 50 plus one and a half CR. Okay. What'd you roll? Uh, 34. Yeah, you got it. All right. Uh, so I performed a clever feint. What's that? Uh, mean? So it is currently flat footed against uh, my allies' attacks until the end of my next turn. Uh, my back. Yep. So he's been cleverly fainted while I'm yelling. There's a, there's a, 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 a dead astronaut behind me, <laughs> and he's got a fucking shiv. <laughs> <laughs> a spaceship. All right, Mudge. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna summon the uh, wonder beast. What was it called again? He is the Tash Tashitari Alpha Wolf. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. <laughs> well, I definitely don't have that. Actually. Mm 
Okay. Don't get stabbed. Alright, you have summoned this thing. I'm pretty sure that's probably my action. He can nut to next round, right? Yeah. Well, then I am going to move. <laughs> okay. This slime is going to... Try to smack you. With the pseudopod. Nope. Not even not close. A not even in the fucking ballpark. Break. He missed by like 10. Break. All right. Bye. Obo. Is this the diamond dog or laser dog? Yes. Nice. All right. Um, I guess I'll just hop up one and slice away. What do we get? A 22. And that is uh, EAC or KAC? Uh, it's melee. Isn't that... Or KAC? I guess. That is a miss. Oof. Oh, we oh, oh. one that was cleverly fainted. Oh. Oh, which means he's minus two. Mm -hmm. That makes it just a hit. God damn it, I forgot about that. Yep, 22 <laughs> on the die, my friend. 11 damage, okay. Ouch. Where were you, Obo? Right here? Yeah, okay. You didn't have to move to attack. Okay, so can I do another one then? Like four rounds? Yeah, but that first one's gonna miss. Oh. So um, don't do it. Okay. I'm giving you that bonus. Don't do it. Uh, Alright, Bash, you're up. Um, let's see. Um... I'm going to take a step back and shoot at this one, this little slimy guy. Which one, top or bottom? Uh, top. On old Topsy McGee. Topsy McGee. Um, All right, Munch, I got you the axle token now. So that's plus eight. Okay. Oh. Is a 16 hit? Oh, which one? Topsies? <laughs> topsies. Oh, no. I'm not going to get Topsies. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and then Theodore. But Theodore is going to come save the day. And he'll... Bash this thing's slimy brains in? Yes. Smash him up. Uh... Beat him up. Smash him up. Beat him up. All right. Plus 10. Okay. 27 to hit. Uh, KAC. Uh, Topsy? Yeah, that's definitely a hit. That's, All a, right. that's a hitsy McGee with the... Oh, was this a first hit? Okay. 23. I'm sorry, how much? 23. Cold and bludgeon. I'm sorry, how much? <laughs> oh. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> All right, well... Okay. The gloves gotta come off then. Fine. Y'all are pumping out wild shit now. <laughs> Doing some math. Sorry. All right. Top of the order to you. This thing, this maroon one. Yeah, fuck it. Fuck it. It's going to press another button. Just need to do another engineering check real quick with this guy. Give me one second. Yeah, 
do that. Uh, then he's going to shoot. The only thing he can see. Starfish. Starfish Mickey. I don't like oh, this. Yeah. I wouldn't either. Is that a 26? Yes. To hit me? Correct. Yeah, that hits. What kind of damage is that? That is from his semi automatic pistol. Wait, it says. Is this the zombie P. or just the, the zombie? He has a gun? <laughs> got a gun, yep. <laughs> Zombies got a gun. <laughs> <laughs> now he's on the run. Who's Bottle it? cat. <laughs> piercing damage? Uh, it says P on it. Yeah, that's piercing. Okay, so my DR once again cuts it by five. Yeah, he just shoots you by it like a, like a gat. Uh, you then notice gravity's gone. Gravity is gone? Yeah, there's no more gravity. Well, that's great. No, it's not. <laughs> no, it's not. All right, slime time. All right, he's still flat-footed and all that jazz, right? Slime time. He's going to slime time. Uh, hmm. All right, so yeah, that's what it's going to do. First thing it does... You can see, like, what looks like batteries and, like, charging devices and stuff start whirring to life inside of it. Like, all these lights inside. Uh, that's its first action. Oh, boy. And then... Uh... Look at all the stars. Yeah. <laughs> Put that on the tube stuff. Um and it's just going it's gonna it's gonna incur, but it's going to Who heard it? Uh, I think it's gonna shoot Glib with a as a red star plasma rifle comes seeping out of its body. Oh no. So what you're saying is we get an artillery laser when we kill this thing, right? Ooh, that's uh but it's gonna be all goopy. I don't care, we can mount it on the ship. Get rid of that <laughs> little that artillery laser guarding the door. <laughs> That'll be sixteen E and F damage. Ow. For the purposes of damage reduction. I think that's electrical <clears throat> and fire. Yep. Row, 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 row. I do not have any DR. I'm not supposed to get hit. Now. I, I thought I told you that. Well, my bad. He shot in what's clearly melee. What happens? Is that he gets smacked or. Oh. Uh, I think he gets smacked, right? Yeah, I think he incurs. Finder shooting in melee. Somebody help me keep me honest. Look, I'm looking it up. I'm trying to look too. <laughs> yep, we well, use your action when it makes a range attack. So, Obo, guy made a range attack. Yeah, the Obo and uh, yep, Wolfie. That's a cool looking wolf, guys. Y'all see that shit? <laughs> it's a sick wolf. Dang. So. Sick wolf, John. The wolf missed. I see that. <laughs> Obo, <laughs> free smack. Wait, 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 wait.
Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> well, it has ooze immunities. I wanted to look at what those were, but it doesn't say AOOs. I think it can't be flanked or something. I don't know. I don't know. Critical. Can't be critted. No. Oh, but we'll get the oboes hit. Glip. Uh, I shoot it again. Actually, I will. Obo, if you're there, you can smack the slime thing. I will slide a little bit. And shoot the gun. At bottom or uh, red or blue? Red. No, not ready. Hey, he shouldn't have had him shoot me. Well. It does a 22 hit flat footed. EAC? KAC. On the money. Okay, so it'll take 23. And also, I'm going to be a giant asshole. It does not get any debuffs because my weapon bounces off of it and shoots the zombie friend down here. Quit. You my burn a resolve friend. point? No, I just have a ricocheting shot. Uh, but eight is probably definitely going to miss. Oh no, Theodore. No. Oh no, Vesh. Oh no. That one's only... Is... God, so love those... Downwards? Or... Well, he shot red, and it bounces down the hallway towards blue. But Natty one zoned. Uh, yeah. Oh, is the zombie colored blue? I don't see the dot. I just see its head. Oh yeah. Sorry. Stupid dots in the fucking space. Yeah. Uh. So. Hmm. We'll do. We'll do this. One. It goes. It. It. It misses the ricochet entirely and goes down. Two. It goes to the right. Nope, that's not what I said. It goes towards Oboe. All right, all right, one for Starfish, two for Oboe, three it misses. You gotta love natural ones. Three it misses. Great. Wow. Dave, Dave, you're up. <laughs> Nailed it. All right, bear back. <laughs> crit fail. Should have did the Starfinder <laughs> table. Oh, that's why the site's gone. I forgot. <laughs> They took down the site. Yeah, you can't go to the site anymore. You gotta like, buy the shit, fucker. <laughs> All right, so I go into melee range with this guy right here, right? <gasps> How dare you? Yes, and then I slap him with all I have. Oh, you monster! You put nanites in this thing again? Yep, I knew it. Oh no, you Fuck just it. fisted the fisted the slime. <laughs> all right. Now is that EAC or KAC? Uh, targets EAC. <gasps> Hit. Mm. Now I got to make fort saves too. Yep, and it does forty-eight, so sixteen points of damage. Oh God! You must make a fortitude saving throw with a DC eighteen or be confused. Nope, it's not immune to confusion. Great. I love that. And was it, what save was it? Fort save? Fort? Yep. For a scavenger slime? Oh. Just a measly. Well, it takes. <laughs> huh? Let's see, so it does it. It takes half the damage and negates the confusion effect. So it takes eight points of damage. Still good. Still, I mean, he's walked up and slapped it, right? Yeah. It's ballsy. No. Sadly, it's going to slap you back now. <laughs> Where I believe is... in the heart of the card. <laughs> uh, it will also spend its action. To start lining up. 
and juicing itself up. Oh boy. Hey, I oh, saw yes. a movie with a slime like this. This is not good for me. All right, here we go. And 18 will miss. Or... Okay. Um, so this is a sticky situation. Who has eaten some nasty damage? Glib. Glib has eaten some nasty damn Sony. Um, well, For now. I'll be like, Glib, you gotta watch your, your, your face. You don't want to get hit. And so you get your 18 stand back. Oh. Damn. Uh, so I believe that's my main action. Yeah, remember, not Pathfinder. Yeah, that's my standard action. Uh, and then my move action will be I'm going to revert to, I guess, south, or I guess this is technically middle guy now, right? Yeah, but I'm gonna red, get, red slime, yeah. Get him? Yeah. I'm going to get him, and do we want a damage boost on that guy, or do we... Do you guys want me to hold on to that? He looks slightly more healthier than the other one. Is he still flat-footed? Uh, it's at the end of my turn. Okay. Um, so as soon as I'm done, he will no longer be flat-footed. But, uh... Yeah, I'll go ahead and burn another resolve to make... Uh, oh, well, no. Well, this is actually good. A resolve point grants this bonus to attack rolls and damage rolls against all enemies who are within 60 feet. So yeah, I'll go ahead and burn that resolve. So everyone gets a plus one to attack and damage rolls against everything. Okay. Okay. But he's no longer flat-footed, right? No longer flat-footed, but he is, he is extra got. He's got it. That's my turn. Oh, that's a good one. Munchie. Plus one. Attack and damage. Special crazy laser dog. Uh, well, it's not the dog yet. It's my turn. So oh. this guy here needs make oh, a wisdom up. save. I will save. Uh-huh. Uh, if he... Okay. So he made it. So it lasts for one round. He is already flat for it. So he becomes off target. Oh, he's not flat-footed anymore. Well, then he'll be flat-footed. There we go. All right, let me put that arrow in his back right back. There we go. And that'll last until <laughs> the end of my turn. Next round. Oh, no. Next round. Okay. End of next uh, round? Yeah. Okay. Uh, and because he pissed my dog off. Uh-oh. Got hurt. He pissed on your dog? You kick my dog, and now my uh, dog is operated. As a focus ray of light burns into the target. And also kills Obo. What a shame. Dang. Had to happen. So I'm assuming that 32 hits. But now Obo 2 joins the party. <laughs> <laughs> yes, 32 <laughs> definitely hits. I'm not that big of a monster. Oh god, can you just imagine that one? How weird that would have been. Obo dies and all of a sudden, like, one round later, a chest burster pops out of his chest and slowly grows into the size of Obo. <laughs> uh, 13 points of fire damage. Did you add your plus one? 14 points of fire damage. <laughs> and well, it's 13 stuff. points of fire damage and one point of morale damage. No, it's fire damage. And what else? Uh, that's it. Fucking laser dog. Oh, Bozaya, you still have free hit on S slime. Yep. I mean, yep. <laughs> yeah, he had an AOO on this thing. Uh, that was your full round attack for the turn, so just give me a regular attack, no full round. Got big money. That's a hit. So one hit, 13 damage. 14 damage. All right. 14 damage. Well, let me check the other ones. 
No, fourteen definitely doesn't get it. Uh, Does the fifteen do it? No. Does the ten do it? Stop asking. <laughs> All right, it's they've well beyond the bloodied state. If blood blood slime could be bloodied, does that mean look, is, is it looking drier or wetter? It's just like the, the like the the part like the, it's not holding all the machine parts in its like form as well, right? They're kind of just like falling to the ground. So it's gloopier. Yes, yes, yes. There you go. You got it. Okay. Uh, Vesh. Hmm. I saw you looking at her. Are you going to run for the ship and get off? Leave, <laughs> yes. leave the crew behind? So long, suckers. <laughs> the truck's mine! <laughs> Let's go, Theodore! <laughs> uh, was Well, then you have to deal with the idiots. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're going to space I'm them as all... soon as we get in there. I'm all right. <laughs> Is uh is Blorp having a bad time with that zombie? <laughs> I'm okay. Like you notice that after he took the armor off that dead rich guy or whatever, that he's he's taking a lot less damage than normal. So yeah. he's fine. All right. Then I'll uh I'll keep taking a shot at that. That you could obviously see Blorp from around the corner of the hallway. Yes. <laughs> Blorp, how you doing? <laughs> Oh, he's stabbing right. my butt. He's right, stabbing my butt. <laughs> <laughs> Zombie stab my butt. Shoot at. You got it. You got Dirty. this. Um. Yeah. Okay. So shoot that butt, Uzi. Oh. Mm, no, it's not gonna get it. All right. Well, then Theodore is going to take it. Save the day. Room. Yep. Natural twin zone here, yes. 28 to hit. Sheesh! Didn't matter what it is. 20. Yeah, that's it. Alright, so. Plus He's about to bash my slime again. 23. Bludgeoning cold. How much was this weapon? This weapon was like 9,000 credits, something like that. 8,000? And how much did y'all have? 100,000? 100,000. My God. Okay. I mean, we yeah. we picked oh, up yeah. everything you you left in front of us. You're right. <laughs> I'm not mad at you. I just it's a really good mace. I'm smiling. If you could see my face, I'm smiling. I just I mean, all the other I think was still somewhere around ninety thousand. Damn. All right. Fair enough. You gotta shop. You gotta shop, right? <laughs> Uh, also don't forget there's no gravity, so any movement's gonna be a bitch. This thing launches towards you. Let's look up, uh, how that works real quick. Did we not turn gravity back on? Oh, wait, he just turned it off, right? Yep, yep. Oh, man. Uh, let's see, cold, blah, blah, blah. And he's welcome to hit me if he wants. It's fine. It's not like there's anything that would happen to him if he hit me. Go on, do it. Do it. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, so you both have to do an acrobatics check or athletics check to avoid getting the off kiltered condition. Athletics. Says a creature that's anchored to a solid object, such as by the boot clamps available with most armor, you receive a plus four to this check. Now he's he's trying to knock me off. Oh, well, first, well, first, yeah, first he's going to slam into you, and then he's going to shank you like a prison bitch, like okay. a zombie prison bitch. Okay, so it's a acrobatics or right. athletics. Okay, plus seven. It's a plus seven of the roll. It's not bad. Nope. No. No. Didn't get it. I'm not gonna do it. As long as they have that stuff too, he has to make the same roll. Trying to find and his. If he can't, then he can't so... take any move actions. 
But before you start adding uh, stuff to it, just so you know, I have a nimble graft, which means I have small hover jets in my feet uh, that afford you similar responsiveness. When you are knocked off kilter, you don't gain the flat-footed condition or take the no normal penalty to attacks. In addition, you can steady yourself as a swift action instead of a move action. So Well... Ah! <laughs> just so you know, well, I'm pretty just much that's rolling. Like, that's awesome. Like session one. So wow. is that based off? I guess Dex or strength bonus? If I don't see it up here, right? I guess. Yeah. Well, Magnum Max is a Dex. Yeah. And Athletics is strength. <gasps> oh, is that a natty one, Sony? Let's see. It's a. That looks very much like a Nat One Sony on his it does. contested acrobatics. It almost sounds like I sidestep him and he hits the wall. Ooh. Uh, what's the next stage after off kilter? I don't know. Is there another stage? Uh, Broken leg. <laughs> Motion. <laughs> Motion sick. So there's Juking. off kilter. There's off target. Off target is you take a minus two penalty to attack rolls while off target. Off kilter is you're flat footed and take a minus two to attack rolls. And you can't take move actions except to right yourself. I'm going to use the rest of super quick. You could let him be nauseated. <laughs> uh, no, but I'll have him zoom right past you. Didn't Maybe he mean just to make throw it around in a circle, <laughs> you know? Try to ride himself and just start spinning around. <laughs> yeah, I'll put him right, right there. Okay, so he doesn't hit me at all, right? Nope. And he doesn't make the attack? Uh, no, he doesn't get to, no. Okay. Uh, he flies right past you into oboe. So now he's in oboeing range. <laughs> yeah. That's... Very true. He did go past you, too, so I don't know if that's an AOO. Uh, in zero G. <laughs> I mean, I'll take it. It's plus six. Plus six. All right. He's going to stab you with this fucking knife, oh well. That's 23 to. He gets his CAC. 23? Mm hmm. Just hits. So that's 1D3. Plus nine because of my improved get him. Uh, Eleven damage. Stop. A nasty punch. All right, Obo, twenty six get you. Uh, yeah. Fourteen damn zoni. All right, next up, red slime coming for the dog. It glows even brighter, and it tries to pseudopod your pooch. That's the bonus. There it is. Will the 22 get the pooch? Uh, yep. That's its turn. Glib, you're... What type of damage is that? Uh, B, bludgeoning. Okay. I'm gonna shoot that slime. Bottom? Lefty or righty? Uh, red. No. Not red. Burning finger! I would like to assume a 25 hits flat-footed. Uh, 
let me get back to it. A what hits what? Yeah, yeah. Are we all floating? Are the slimes anchored to the ground, or are they floating too? They're anchored. They're like slurping to like the ground and stuff. Glib's holding on by his tail. All right, uh, bullet ricochet is over to zombie man. That was seventeen to red. Uh, twenty six. It dies. Huzzah. Uh, is zombie man still get him? Uh, I think I haven't had my turn yet. So yes, it should still be. Everything within 60 feet of me has still uh, been extra got it. Okay. Uh, 12 misses, though. Indeed. All right, that's Indeed. me. Wasn't a critical miss, though. Nah. Davy. One slime left, Davy. Uh-oh. Wow, since I'm still in melee range. You're just going to backhand it? Yes. Oof. Oof. That is a hit. And you need that fort save, that lovely, lovely fort save. Where's that stupid thing at? Fort save. It wouldn't make that fort save, so a total of nine damage. Dead. I slapped at the death, guys. Can you believe that? <laughs> you bitch slapped the hell out of it. Blorp. Okay. Well, um, there's still a Zamboni. And the other slime has been deadified, right? Correct. Both slimies are gone zony. Mm-hmm. Excellent, excellent. So I will uh, just do a regular got him on Zombie Astronaut. And uh, do I think this uh, creature has an intelligence score? Oh, I'm looking at the wrong one, sorry. I mean... You witnessed it press buttons. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and clever faint him. So here comes the bluff. That's 33 versus, I believe, it was either his 10 plus sense motive or 15 plus 1.5 CR. Does a 33 faint him? Yes. Okay, well he is flat footed for everybody. Forever. Yep, and he's got he's regular god and flat footed. So dead. Munji. Okay. Hey, we'll throw a pink. Sixteen. You said sixteen. Yep, EAC, RKAC, whatever the Wait, physical. I see eighteen. What are you talking about? Well, because uh, we're in the dark. It was like a minus four to hit. That's you can see in the dark. <clears throat> I can see in low light. Oh. Well, the dog shines light. Say, so, and the slime was just emitting like light everywhere oh, okay, too. And then eighteen. <laughs> 18, and he's flat-footed, right? Uh, yep. And that's which one, KAC or EAC? It'd be KAC. Uh, yeah, that hits. Uh, and he takes six points of damage as a pancake smacks him. First damage. Ooh. Uh -huh, and a doge. Guess see what his strength is, so... You gotta make a acrobatic. Oh, he gets a plus fourteen. What's happening? Well, to be able to move, he's gotta make an acrobatics, right? Oh yeah. Yep. Yeah, one thirty-three. 
Well, that's just uh, that was if I was running into somebody, I had the maintenance check to to not be off kilter. Yeah, but since there's gravity, we have to be to do it to not be off kilter, right? Yeah, you're right. He will move there, and then he will shoot a beam of light. And kill Oboe. What a shame. Oh, uh, 37. Yeah, I have. Uh, 18 fire damage. Cute, cute. Very cool dog. Obozaya. There's a zombie. Where is Obo? Charlie! I mean... Charlie! Charlie! That nine is rough. 23 is a hit, though. 15 damage. I assume you didn't want to move nowhere, too. Uh, nah, yeah, I'm good. Alright, Vish. What now? Um. Hmm. Hmm. Theodore's gonna move further down the hallway. Let's see. Through there. It's a couple 30. Um. Alright, so it's just the... The... Zombie spaceman left? Yes. Okay. Um... So get this. If you're off kilter, right, you can use a move action to steady yourself that requires to, a surface to grab or some method of propulsion, right? Alternatively, you can throw an item weighing at least four bulk to reorient yourself and remove the off kilter condition. <laughs> Whoa. You just throw trash. Heavy trash. Alright. Theodore will get in this guy's biz. Yeah, come on. Get this zombie. Uh, and does he, like, have legs or does he fly? He has legs, but he has climbing claws. So he's just constantly, like, adhered to the. Yeah, he's just Floor. on the ground. It's gross. Mm, then it's real gross. Then we'll take that thirty. Then five ten. And go another twenty. Trying to loop around. Uh, but I guess that's it for me. Dude, we can't attack yet. No, you had to do double move to get in this base. All right. Hmm. It doesn't like robots. <laughs> it's going to stab the robot. Gonna stab it. Oh, he's gonna stab it. Gonna stab the robot. Is that against Casey? That is against, yeah, Casey. Uh, no, that's a mess. <sighs> and it just snarls in your face. <laughs> Glip! Plan A shoot the zombie. Yeah, how does the ammo work on this gun of yours, too, by the way? I've got like six rounds before I have to reload. Uh, I don't think it's ever come up. Usually stuff dies in six rounds. Oof, I'm pretty sure a 14 won't hit it flat-footed. No. Then I missed. It's already flat-footed, though. That's super flat-footed. Double foot. <laughs> it's, right, no, it's no footed. Where is this next target? 
Obaziah needs to duck. You also need to make me an athletics or an acrobatics check. Unless you have some way of traveling through zero gravity. You say you want an athletics check? Oh, wait, no, no. Oh, no, hook can go anywhere. Oh. Carver. No, oh, can he ride Obo? Oh, DC <laughs> 20. Oh. So you are off kilter. Uh, it says that yeah, you're doing it to safely stop. I'll take that as you may. You slam into the wall. It's the kind of like you ding wherever you're trying to land and kind of like rotate sideways. Mm -hmm. Okay. So just go ahead and apply that a condition and do your thing as you shoot Obo in the back of the head. To tell him to sit there and uh. It's a duck. Put your head in your shell like a turtle. <laughs> we don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Holy crap! To what level spell is that? <laughs> what? What? That's my third level spell. <laughs> it was. That's it. To all creatures and objects in the area. Oh, wait. How big what, is this? What's the range on that, that area? <laughs> on that, is that. Uh, range is 120 feet. Oh, boy. Oh boy. Oh uh, wow. That's where how far you can cast it. What's the A AOO of this thing? Tell me you just set off like a 120 foot electrical it's new. A, it's a line. It's a line. It's a lightning bolt. Let's see. I think. Right? Unleash a line of electricity from a massive outside. Go for sure. Yeah, that's a line. That's pretty much okay. it's a lightning okay. bolt. Okay. So it's okay. going to go through everything. Okay, so oh, it looks like it's touching. Looks like it's touching. So you can miss Obo and maybe hit the starfish. Miss the starfish and absolutely obliterate Obo. <laughs> you or... know, I, I do have DR against electricity, so. There so you does go. Theodore. Yeah, yeah I can See? eat it. There I can you eat go. it. <laughs> I can take it. It's so a 36 electric damage. Okay, yeah, it's a reflex save. Okay. Reduce. Oh, I had to reflex to reduce it. Huh? So that's 31 damage to me. That's fine. Uh, he might hit this. Let me see. Uh, that's so crazy. Hit it exactly. What a spell. Remember, I did. I, I did sit there and say I might be here to kill you guys. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Uh, you also see that the spell just continued and shot through some of the ship. You hit a lot of electrical stuff. You know, oh yeah, it's bad. Uh, Blorp. Well, um, I've been freshly electrocuted. So I'm not having a great time. Um, but I will once again up the get him on the uh, undead fella. And uh, I don't think I would be able to intimidate him. So I'm just going to continue to cleverly faint him. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So here comes the bluff. Okay, yeah, so he's once again flat <laughs> He just doesn't know what to do with his life. 
Bungie. Alright, uh, I am going to pancake the guy. 27. Yep. Five points of bludgeoning damage. Yep. The wolf hits him again with a 34. Mm hmm. For 11 more fire damage. Okay. That's my turn. Obozaga. Pancakes, bitches. Obo. Obo. Obo, can you hear me? <laughs> yeah, what's up? Sorry. You're good, but zombie right in front of you. Oh, it's my turn? He's all fucked up, yeah. Alright, but. Swing, swing, swing. Swing and a miss. Got the obo. Oh, Bozaya. <laughs> Alright, Vash. Alright. Uh, Theodore's gonna try and smack this dude. Whatever he's got. He's, he's got got. Alright, so I have that plus one. Okay. Does a 26 hit KAC? Uh, yep. Eight. Um, plus one to damage two, right? Okay. Oof, that's a bad roll. Sixteen damage. Uh, oh. And we're out of initiative. Has uh, gravity been restored? I uh, know, as a matter of fact, and there's a giant electrical burn hole in the side of the ship. Uh, let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> Come here, doggy. Go away. <laughs> Everyone make me a will save. Will save. A Wilson save. Okay. It was more like a won't save. Mm -hmm. And oh, Bash and Obo are the only ones that resist that very familiar static. <laughs> okay, that's good. And Munchie? Uh, nope. Then how did Obo say with a 21? I didn't with a 21. Plus two for fear effects. Oh wait, it's a fear effect. Hold mm -hmm. on. Oh what? Uh, uh bonus saving throws against death effects, disease, mind affecting effects, paralysis, poison, sleep effects, and stunning effects. Was that any of those? <laughs> I'm sorry. Death, disease, mind oh. affecting, mm -hmm. paralysis. Yeah. Mind yeah, affecting. That's one. All right, so I have a plus one, so that puts me to twenty. That would you would say? Yes, twenty three. If you failed, you are stunned for one round. As you hear in the back of your head, you stole my stuff. Then you blow up my ship. I thought we were friends. It wasn't us, some undead guy. Um, I really hate to do this. <laughs> I'm going to have to call it here. Yeah, I know. I know, but we <laughs> can throw up the, at least the Anish. Oh, this is so bad. Why'd you blow his ship up and steal stuff? <laughs> you still could talk your way out of it. 
still possible. I mean, we're way closer to the door. I've seen y'all talking way out of worse. I'll say we're way closer say? to the door than he is to us. We could just, like, hightail it. Yeah. Define us. <laughs> Everyone in this hallway, right? Who, who's not? Oh. <laughs> I still love you, Chris. <laughs> Go on without me. <laughs> oh, where is he at? I don't see him. Tell my story, Carver. <laughs> Tell my story, Theodore. I'm, I'm getting hugged by the Ellicott right now. No, he's not that close. <laughs> he's he's more in the room. I just wanted to bring him in there. <laughs> How'd you get all the way down there? What are you doing down there? I was on the I was on the opposite side of the hallway. Oh, so I went around. See y'all in luck. He rolled a fat two for an ish. Oh, so we're we gonna run? Or are we just gonna kill this guy? <laughs> or do we want to try to talk our way out of it? <laughs> <laughs> Look, I got this really cool idea how we can handle it. We run, we sit there and leave, and we open the front door. Or I just cast Ray's dead on him, and we end the fight in one second. Because, <laughs> if I remember correctly, I did sit there and cast Life of Old on everyone. We can go now. I should just put down some photon cannons and some siege tanks, and I mean, because he's a fucking zergling overlord, and, you know. Yeah. <laughs> We could flee into our ship and then just open fire on this derelict. <laughs> yeah, but no, then like, he has the guardians. And the fight parts, we never fixed his ship, so... He's not going anywhere. <laughs> That's rough. You know, just... Wait, where are you going? No, fight me! <laughs> no! <laughs> Come back and fight me! I'm so lonely. I just want to touch it. <laughs> I'm sorry. We can we start over? <laughs> my chest. <laughs> I'll see y'all next week. Good right. sesh. See you later, man. All right, guys. GG's. I'll take it easy. Good night. All right, Good night. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the session. Uh, and yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.